Vanilla Monsoon back here at ringside with my man, Richie Estrada. And we already see in the ring right now, Ray Rosas, who is the contender for the Fist Combat Championship tonight, making her first Fist Combat Championship defense. There we see her, Ruby fucking Ray. She uh, gained the championship by beating B-Boy. She's the new Fist Combat Champion. This is going to be very, very exciting to see her in her first title defense. I'm really interested to see how she's going to defend that championship. She's no longer a challenger, ladies and gentlemen. She is now the champion. Now she has to prove herself more than ever. Well, good. You brought up the B-Boy match. Let's talk a little bit about that. A very hard-fought contest. B-Boy losing the title to Ruby Rays. However, refused to shake her hand after the match. And I'm telling you right now, Richie, I know for a fact Ruby is fucking pissed off about this. And Vanilla, you've been in the business for quite some time, a very long time, and respect in the wrestling business is it's it's a code of conduct. It's 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 a very spoken rule. And when someone doesn't shake your hand, I mean explain to the to the audience out there who don't understand the importance of a handshake between two wrestlers. Well well it's a handshake. It's respect. It's knowing that you put your body on the line to go out there and entertain people every day of your life. If you're a professional wrestler, that means something. So you gotta, you have to have respect for your fellow wrestler. Whether you like them, whether you hate them, you gotta have respect for them at the end of the day. So, kudos to Ruby Rays for not totally flipping the fuck out after B-Boy didn't shake her hand. But I tell you, she took it a lot better than I would've. Yeah, B-Boy Young Bucks for Booker T, you get that reference. Hey, I love it, baby, I love it. And there's the championship right there. Ray Rosas was playing around, being a jerk already before the match even started. And again, this is a new time in wrestling, ladies and gentlemen. We are seeing a lot more women go up against men. And for the men to act like fools and to take the, their female competitors lightly is a huge mistake. Hey, and maybe that's what B-Boy did. Maybe B-Boy was upset with himself that he took Ruby too lightly and lost the championship to him. As you see, B-Boy. We haven't heard from B-Boy up until this point. Since he lost the championship, we haven't heard from him. He's not part of the Strong Style Tournament in September, which is a, you know, a huge letdown for us in this combat. And you just gotta wonder, where's B-Boy's head at? I don't know. I guess uh, B-Boy's gonna have to answer that question. He's uh, got a long journey ahead of him. Rediscovery for him. Unfortunately for him, but fortunately for the new champion, Ruby Rays, she's got the gold. Well, Ray Rosas, not a slouch either. 15-year vet, he's been all over the place. He's a, he's a trainer of professional wrestlers, and he's somebody that knows what the fuck he's doing. So for her, him to go in there against Ruby Rays is gonna be a hell of a match. I know they have fought before, but never for the Fist Combat Championship. Someone's a uh, LA Rams fan. You see the logo on uh, Ray's tights. He's telling everybody to shut the fuck up. Handshakes. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay, Ruby's like, I don't know about this. I don't know. I've been fucking, I've been lambasted before. I don't know if that's a very smart idea. Ray Rose is showing her that he can't shake her hand. He's shaking the referee's hand, announcing Ray Short's hand, the crowd's hand. Yeah. Wait. Be a man, he said. <laughs> I tell you, I like this guy. I, I haven't seen very much of him, but I already like this guy, Ray Rosas. See, and you know, thinking about it while we're here right now, I wonder if B-Boy didn't shake her hand. He could have not shaken her hand for a number of reasons. Because she's a woman? Because she just beat him? Because he's pissed off at himself? I don't know. We haven't heard from B-Boy. Well, maybe we'll hear from B-Boy pretty soon, but there's a handshake. There okay. it is, solidified. And oh! I don't blame her. That's why she didn't want to shake the hand. Ray Rosas, a little underhanded tactics there. Well, he turned that oh. handshake into a fist, and there are some Ric Flair-like chops. And Ruby, already on the attack. Yep. Oh! Oh! Thunderous chop by the champ. You took the words right out of my mouth, Richie. But it wasn't enough. Now he's on the offense. He's got her in a headlock. To the 
ropes. The gunner. Ray, what is he up to? He's going back on the ropes. Oh! And a boot to the face, taking down the challenger. And maybe he, uh, he'll turn out that smile a little bit more now. He takes his uh, opponent oh. a little bit more serious. He had a knee to the stomach. And just a few minutes ago, we saw Rose smiling like a, like oh. a joker. A club to the back of Ray Rosas. Now Interesting he's here. Ruby Rays against Ray Rosas. Battle of the Double R's. Yeah, that's a heavy alliteration, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> he's trying to tell the champion, wait. Break to the eye. Dirty but effective. Yo, Fist Combat putting themselves on the map here. We've got a female top champion. And you know what? If anybody has the balls to say that she's a champ because she's a female, anything like that, they're idiots. I put Ruby Rays up there against any competitor, guy or girl, on the fucking planet. I'm talking Brock Lesnar all the way down to Johnny Jabroni. <laughs> or, uh... The Brooklyn Brawler. There it is, Brooklyn, uh, Brooklyn Ball. From Barry Horowitz. I was thinking uh, James Elworth. Uh, James Ellsworth, his name was uh, lost. Him him to Gilbert. 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 Pretty fucking tough, too. And this is a very unorthodox uh, submission hold right there. What would you call that, Vanilla? Ah, uh, hurts. Hurts, don't it? <laughs> and we just saw Roses with a little Ric Flair strut there. Maybe Ray took her a little bit lightly. Yeah. I don't know. Punch to the face. The yeah, champion wanna, is reeling. I want to talk a little bit about it, this right now, too, because it applies. Ray Rosas. This is his debut in Fist Combat, and he's fighting for the championship. Let me tell you why, Richie. You know why, right? Because Fist Combat is the finest independent stars today. So I don't care if you've wrestled exclusively in Europe. If you're one of the best independent wrestlers today, you are on top of our fucking contenders list immediately. And already we've seen that championship held by B-Boy, by Joey Ryan. B-Boy, Joey Ryan again, B-Boy again, and now Ruby Reyes. Absolutely, and perhaps Ray Roses. Perhaps. He could win the championship on his fist debut. That would be absolutely impressive. Hey, Ruby did it. Ruby won a championship on her fist debut. That's so who knows? Point. Ray could do it right here. Ah, and so did Joey Ryan. Yeah. Very amazing point. So if you make your debut, chances are you can win the championship. You could definitely and win a championship. He's got her in the ropes, and I str and I can't stress this enough. In any regular promotion, that would be absolutely illegal. But in fist combat, the ropes are kind of your friend if you use them to your advantage. And the champion is reeling. She has not been able to get back up on her legs. Ray, there. Oh! That's gonna slow you down, no matter who you are. Oh! And she kicked that rope right where the sun doesn't punish her. Yeah, that looked like that was a knee to the face, but worse than that, it was a kick to the ropes. Also hitting the, the uh, grapefruits there. Ray, careful, careful. There's a bat. And that's a bat that we saw earlier in the playpen death match. It's still making its presence known. And what a incredible shot. Not enough to put down the champion. Oh, you gotta be oh, kidding me. He's using that chain that's hanging down from the light on the ceiling. Champion's in trouble. There's no count outs. Definitely no count outs. And the challenger is taking advantage. There's, there's the bat again. Oh, puts it away. Oh! Race come back. Knee to the gut. Another knee. Now she's got the bat. Nope, she got rid of it. Knee to the face. Big knee to the face right there. That'll knock a couple teeth. Yeah, the champion. Doing a lot of knee strikes. A low blow, I, I guess. That's, that's, that's not going to work, bro. <laughs> He's hitting her in the taco. It ain't working. And again, they're outside in the crowd. No padding on that floor. That is cement. Uh -oh. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Oh, gosh. The champion trying to fight a suplex. No, no, no. Oh, I thought he was going to suplex her on the floor. Oh, no! Oh! Oh! Right on the concrete. You could hear that splat all the way downtown on Coronado Island. Yeah, that, Jesus. Su that suplex was for the challenger, but it was hard enough to hit both challenger and champion. You see referee Alex Lee to, to check to make sure if they're okay. I don't see how they could be. Is she going for a cover? This is not a false count anywhere match. 
You gotta bring your challenger back into the ring, champ. That, that is one thing that's legit here, is that pinfalls and submissions generally have to happen in the ring. I wouldn't be surprised if somebody does lose on the outside, though, because we're very unpredictable here. Oh man, low blow shots again with that bat. That bat has seen some better days. These two are just beating the shit out of each other. And to her credit, the champion, Ruby Rays, staying on the offense. It looks like she, she hasn't been uh, tired. She's not, she doesn't look fatigued. No. So that's that's good on her part. The challenger, Ray, on the other hand, not so much. He's been getting his ass kicked here. Yeah, absolutely. There's a pin. Here we go. One, two, and... Oh. Kick out by Ray Rosas. He's still in this match. How much How much left does he have in the tank? Still on his knees. The champion getting back to, uh, getting back on her feet. And again, with those knees to the face, she's just doing knee strike after knee strike after knee strike. She's going to the ropes. Flapjack. And maybe that's the advantage. Big flapjack, he needed that right there. Yeah, that's the opening that he probably needs. But he's so fatigued, he's so tired, he's noticing that he's not getting on his opponent. He's, getting, he's catching his breath. I don't blame him, Richie. Look at that. He's favoring his back there. I'm sure that's probably because of the suplex that happened on the outside. Most definitely. Yeah, and a foot to the face. And that looked like uh, more frustration from... Ruby Ray's there. That didn't look like a, a methodical uh, foot to the face. She looked like she did that just because she was annoyed. She is on the ropes. Wow! Oh! Double knees to the gut after a cartwheel. And a beautiful cartwheel at that. Holy shit, Ruby. Not enough to put away uh, Ray, however. Impressive move, for sure. Hey, I brought it up earlier. Let's bring it up now. September 9th, the Strong Style Tournament. Eight of the baddest motherfuckers to grace a ring, primarily on the West Coast, are gonna go at it in a one-night tournament. Thornstow and Luster of the Reno Scum, Jesse and Hoss of True Grit, Ruby Rays, KLD, Bateman, and Brody King. Holy shit, is that gonna be a hell of a show on September 9th, right back here. Yeah, it's gonna be an amazing event, ladies and gentlemen. We hope you join us, follow us on our social media, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Fist Combat TV. That's right. We don't have Instagram. Yet. Yet, yet, yet. Why? Because we're because we're socially social media incompetent, I guess. <laughs> well, well, when you got a promotion with Dirty Ron, incompetence is probably gonna be uh, on the playing field. Here's the thing, I don't think we have a leader around here. I think the inmates are running the fucking asylum. Oh definitely. And uh the champion, she looks like she's out. Are we gonna see a title change here? Possibly. On two, here we go. New champion. Oh! She's hovering above the mat. She's got life in her. Ruby, digging down. See what she's made of. And I think she's got it. What's going on? Shot to the gut by Ray Rosas. She didn't win the championship because she gave up too easily, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness, that was impressive. Going for the sunset flip. Oh, his ass is out. Nice ass, Ray. He oh. must do squats. Hang around Joey Ryan too much, probably. And a double-A spine buster. That'll do it right there if she can get over and make the pin. I know we just had a total eclipse this week, but Jesus with that ass. Total eclipse of the ass, bro. And both champion and challenger are down on the floor. You see referee Alex doing a double count out. It would be a shame for this match to end like that. We'll see who can get up on their feet first. I'm anxious to see how this one ends. Because combined on the last two shows, we have had five title changes. And both. So and who knows what's going to happen today? Down the feet. We'll be going to the uh, corner there. Big splash in the corner. And another big clothesline. Ruby is heating up, as they used to say on NBA Jam. Get the champion. Building momentum. Oh, wait. Or not. Oh, don't hit the mirror. Yo, and Ray. Oh, big forearm. That's it. Oh, what are we going to see here? This does not look good. I have seen videos good. of this. Holy shit. That's it. That's it. One, neck breaker? two, and... Oh, no! There is life.
life in Rey Rosas. And what does the champion have to do to put away the challenger? That amazing swing and deck breaker from no, the third row. Move. Yeah. If, if, for that to not take out Ray Rosas, it makes me wonder what what does the champion have left? What she got left in her arsenal? Yeah. I have no idea. Oh, is that get over here, bitch? Yeah, whatever it is, she does look determined. It's the one thing that I admire about uh, Ruby Rays. She does not have fear in her bones. Oh! Ace Crusher! Rays looking for the title! One! Two! And that's a, oh, no! Whoa, was that three? Was that three? Was that two? Was that was two? not three. It was just two. That was not oh. three. Referee Alex. One. And the uh, elbow pads come off. Shades of Dwayne Johnson. I don't know. Oh, you know, that's a start. Is he going to do a people's elbow? I doubt it. No, uh, he's not of the people, so it's just an elbow. Right. Yep. Hits the ring post. Oh, that'll knock his shoulder out of place. Oh, shit. Here comes Ruby. Oh, double knees in the corner. Oh, yeah. Belly to back. Beauty. What she a hits beauty. It. Can she go for a pin? She's reeling. She's reeling. Or maybe not. Here we go. She's looking like Raiden from Mortal Kombat. Super mm. kick. And that took her out. Is that going to be enough? One, two, and a new champion. Oh, oh my God. And look at the frustration on Ray Rose's face. He thought he had it, but it was not enough to put away the champion. Ruby Rays is still holding on. And if Ray Rose's wants to get back on the offense, he needs to get on her right now instead of just looking frustrated. And, and as you can see right now, oh, come on. Come on. She's yelling at her. I think you just grabbed her by the pussy. I'm not yeah, sure. I didn't even want to bring that up. We already brought up that guy one too many times. There's a fireman's carry. Oh! Oh no, Ray's grabbing onto that top rope. Intelligent move there by the vet. I thought we were going to see another belly to back. There he goes on the ropes. And a spear! Oh! Big spear off the springboard. One, two, and three. That's it. Ruby Rays, still your fist combat champion. And handshake or no handshake, that was a decisive victory. And she successfully retains her title in a very impressive first championship match. Absolutely. Absolutely. What an impressive, impressive showing by our Fist Combat Champion, Ruby Rage. Giving it everything she's got, male or female, she's the fucking champ, and every contender is gonna have to deal with her. Vicious, she's tired, but she won. Vicious and destructive. Ruby, still your Fist Combat Champion. And it makes me wonder uh, what other challengers will be gunning for her championship and do they have what it takes to go up against a very powerful, very determined Fist Championship, excuse me, Fist Champion. Ruby Ray's our only female competitor in the Strong Style Tournament. She requested to be in this tournament, not only to prove that she is the best of the best, but also to prove that as the Fist Combat Champion, she is one of the most elite wrestlers on the planet. And she's on the mic. Let's hear what she got to say. Words from our champion. What a piece of shit a lot of you motherfuckers are. Oh. Go ahead and cheer, shit for brains. After my last match, I went to shave the boy's hand. My very first fucking time here at Fist. And I won. And I won this. All I wanted to do was shake the boy's hand. Thank you. 
safety. Wow. Where, where did that come from? Wow. We'll be right back here with the tag team finals right after this, Richie.